Hello guys, this is Joe Takeda. Welcome back to another episode of The Legend of Zelda Wind Waker HD Edition. This month is Zelda month, so every month, I mean every day you will see you see me posting a video of this game. So uh, before I tackle the before I tackle the, the north and south temples, I wanted to try to get this teleport thing in. Yes, I heard that he actually allows me to teleport. Let me. Yep. Yes. Finally. Finally. Got him. So that means that I won't have to spend that much time selling around. That's a heck of an arm you got there. And what an eye. No one's ever been able to spot me in there before now. You obviously have mastery of the air. And now that we've established that you're quite the wind waker, let's see if you can handle this. And uh, handle what? What? Down. Oh, I think it's. I think it's this one. Down. Right. Left. Up. You learn the ballad of the gales. Ooh, wahoo! In the hands of a windmaker like you, my adorable little cyclones will be as happy as can be. If you need to move like the wind over the ocean deeps, just call on my cyclones. Well, I guess I'll head for home now. See you on down the road. Woohoo! Awesome! I finally got a teleport thingy. So before I do anything else, I want to save because I don't want to lose my progress of getting a win. Okay, done and done. And now that we got a win, wait, we should go. Oh, wrong one. So down, right, left, up. There's actually one thing I would like to do first. It's to go back to. Oh, cool. Ooh. Okay, it's to go back to my hometown first. Oh, say goodbye to my selling days so I don't have to waste so much time selling left to the right, to the left, to the right, to the north. Oh. So, you might be wondering why I'm heading back home. It's because I would like to purchase some items. Uh, can you sell a bit faster? Lost wind and I would like to get more bait for more hints from the fish. Just during off camera screen I noticed that the fish are actually quite useful on giving some hints. So that is precisely what I'm planning to do. So let us go in here, do some quick purchase. Oh. Uh, so me bones for cheap. Okay, uh, okay, browse. What's this? 30 bombs. Okay, I'm gonna buy this a lot. Uh, silver membership. What does that do actually? Okay, right, 6. I'll try to buy around 12 or something. Uh, six, nine, twelve. Okay, maybe I'll buy one more. Okay. Bye. Yeah, goodbye. And now, and now, and now, can I actually use the the wind gal thing here? Oh, okay. You can only call up the cyclone when you're in your boat. So let me climb up here and summon the wind. Oh, uh, right, left, up, and I do. Hmm. Okay, this is. Okay, let me try to go here first. Oh, there's a seashell over there. 
Let's see if I could check out what place is that. Go, 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 go. Huh. Put that away. Get out of the freaking water. Hide out. Hey, what's so special about this place? Oh. Oh. Can I blow this? Wait, let me check my mailbox. Oh, three ladders! Look, yeah, don't, don't, don't you puke on me. How are you doing, Rel? Do you have enough of granny soup? Where are you now? You may be closer than I suspect. Are you hungry? Are you keeping warm? You haven't injured yourself, have you? You always work so hard, Rel. Do you have enough rupees? Your grandma doesn't have a lot, but I'm sending you everything I've saved up. As long as I have you and Arrow, I don't need anything else. I just want the two of you to return home safely. Love, Grandma. Oh, Grandma. Oh, thank, thanks for the ten, 20 rupees. What? Cash on delivery? Postage due is 21 rupees? What? Okay, let's see what this is all about. To the esteemed Mr. Ferry person, thank you very much for your purchase. Enclosed is an incredible chart. This chart will show you where you can find the Triforce charts and Triforce shards. I want you to use it to find lots of them. They are my favorite kind of items. And also, sir, have you been checking your Tingle chart? Have you seen those giant fairy marks? Follow the chart to them and your fortune will increase greatly. Tingle. Yeah, but I just wasted 200 plus rupees on your stupid chart. Okay, what's the last letter? Hi, have you been, Big Brother? I'm here on the pirate ship writing you this letter. Isn't that neat? Oh, neat. At first, I was really scared, but they're all actually nice. For pirates, I mean. Mr. Gonzo is a really big guy, but ever since Miss Tetra left, he's been crying like a baby. It's kind of funny, but sort of sad too. Nudge is a little strange, but nice too. And as for Senza, his beard makes him look pretty mean, but he tells really cool stories when he gets in the right mood. Zuko's kind of weird, but Marco is pretty quiet. Mako immediately gets mad whenever I try to take his glasses. So I do that a lot. <laughs> As usual, Nico is always fooling around. He won't take anything serious. Actually, he seems sad not to have you around anymore. Were you guys good friends? I helped them all out with their chores and they actually paid me a little for it. So I'm sending the money to you. Please use it, big brother. I'll loan you my telescope for a little longer. But you have to return it to me eventually, okay? I'm doing fine here, so don't you worry. I'll take care of myself. So you'll be sure to take good care of yourself. Good luck. Oh, thanks for the 20 rupees, but it's not... Actually, I would prefer you give me more because I just saved your ass, man. So, so let me see if there's a way for me to bomb this thing. Oh, shoot, shoot. Why do I always press the wrong button? Oh. Okay, what's inside? Oh? A secret? Oh, it's a secret! <laughs> Young Waker of the Winds, allow me to aid you in your quest. Are you going to give me a piece of heart? This power! Oh, you can now carry more bombs! Now you can carry a maximum of 60 with you wherever you go. Oh, cool! Oh, cool! I didn't know that. Maybe I should have done that earlier. So let us quickly get out of here. And now let us try to sail over here. So I'm gonna summon the wind first. Oh, excuse me, guys. <sighs> oh, wait, what? Okay, where's my thing keyboard? Okay, Mr. Dragon Dude, time to go. And I believe our destination is around here. Okay, I wonder how we will be able to. 
I wonder if that's the south temple. Yeah, I mean, it's pointing to me at that direction, so I'm pretty sure that's the south temple. Uh, uh huh. So sadly, some more selling. <laughs> Okay, uh, do you guys see, see any any special island? Or maybe some fish that is willing to give me some good hints on what the heck I'm supposed to do? I mean, I, I shouldn't complain because I've gotten the power of the wind, the wind of gale which allows me to teleport, thank goodness and also the ability to carry 60 bombs alrighty then okay, I saw a fish in the distance, so let me quickly eat this. Yep, what's the fish? Yep, the fish is over there. Let's see what does the fish have to say. Come on, almost there. I'm pretty sure that's the location. I like to check my I like to check my map because I don't like to get lost. I'm not really a fan of getting lost that often. Okay, fish. What do you have to say to me? Here's some bait for you. Okay, I think that's pretty much the soft temple. Small fry, there's a real heavy stone head blocking a cave on that island. Don't you wonder what's behind it? Don't you want to get in there? Hee <laughs> hee, let me tell you a great secret. If you go north 4 squares and east 3 squares to Fire Mountain, you find an item that gives you strength so to easily lift anything, no matter how heavy it is. 4 north 3 east. With that thing, you could lift that stone and toss it out of nowhere as if it were light as a feather. That's all the info I've got to offer. If you want to hear again, blah blah blah, same thing. Oh, so according to him, he said that there's a heavy stone on this island. So I need to go 4, 3, 4, and 1, 2, 3. I think it's around here. Or maybe it's around here. It's either this square or that square. But he said go 4, 1, 2, 3, 4, 2, 3. So I think it's around here somewhere. So let us quickly summon our wind. Check it out. Nah. Okay, maybe we could try to scout from here. Thank God for no lo loading screen. Ah, so we are back here at the Tower of the Gods. So, up, left, right. Law of this. Okay, let's go. Let's go, Red Lion. And let's see if we can find the... Oh, there's another fish. Let me try to talk to that fish. Hey, fish bro. Any good hints you're going to give me again? Oh, it's just, it looks like a snow, no string. I've done a feast fortune on you, small fry. Uh, you're fated to come to this place many times, and the keys that control the fate are no other than the lucky items known as the Triumph Forks. Yeah, there's some sort of magical utensils. Uh, if you want to learn more about the Triumph Forks, talk to that guy, Tingo. That's what the fish fortune told me. Okay, okay, maybe next time I'll look for Tingo. But not now, because I've been asked to go get the power bracelet. I'm in the right direction. Yep. Okay, so Fire Mountain, I believe. I believe I believe I'm supposed to look for the Fire Mountain. 
So I'm gonna spend about one to two minutes selling again. <laughs> If only the wind of girls allow me to teleport to any squares on the map, then yeah, I should be awesome. But I could only see this one huge tower. I can't help but wonder if that is the if that is the fire mountain. Doesn't seem like it though. like a volcano thingy <clears throat> so I can assume that I'm on the correct direction oh, it's raining I can see shit uh, I, okay there's a lot of smoke coming out looks like a volcano thingy oh maybe that is the place okay ah yep but Oh, great fish! Please impart me your great wisdom on what to do because I'm lost as ASF. I'm lost AF. You see that damn volcano that's spewing out lava like there's no tomorrow? Yeah, well, they say there's a great treasure hidden inside that thing. The thing is, everyone's ever tried to get inside has been just blasted away by the great balls of fire that come shooting off the top. If you want to get inside, you ought to go to the island. You got you ought to go find the island that's one square north, four square west of here, and that's where the power to freeze anything is hidden. What? I have to go one square north and four square west? Or oh, so they say. Maybe it's not true. But you're gonna have to look fry. Okay, more traveling. One square north, four square west. One, then one, two, three, four. So I'm supposed to head over there. Oh, it was such a wild goose chase. Oh, I can just try we go here. Oh, that's good. I don't need to sell. Spend time selling so much. What? Why am I? What the heck is this place? I don't know, some fish just guide me here. I am the queen of the fairy world. What is the matter, my child? Does that not surprise you, young one? I like you. And so I shall give new power to the ball that you built. Ooh. What? Does, are you going to give my ball some auto-target system? Or maybe some GPS function. Ah! Don't, don't, ah! Uh, don't pop my heart! Uh. The power of fire and ice has been added to your arrows. When you take out your ball, use ZR to change arrowheads and then fire away. Oh. Progress! Ice arrows can freeze the hottest flames, and fire arrows can melt the coldest ice. Ooh. The fairies in this fountain will ease your barrenness. Use them as you need to. 
Ciao. I must tell you, you are just my type. Hee hee hee. Uh, okay, I'm not uh, necrophilia. I'm not into ghosts, girls. Thank you very much. Oh, we got new bow and arrow power. That's good, that's good. So let us quickly go back to the volcano. Place thingy. Can I just teleport there? No. Of course not. You can only te teleport to a specific location. Why am I not surprised? Back at the Dragon Roost Island, and now we have to summon the South Wind. The South Wind. And then to the South we go. Towards the. Towards the. Towards the volcano thing. Since we've already got our bow and arrow ready, I think we can freeze the entrance of the. Okay, now and then we can just easily sell in. Am I almost there? I really wish they could put like a small mini map <coughs> on the screen, like maybe on the southeast or north, the top left of my screen, so I don't have to keep bringing up the map. Oh well, alright, we are here, so let me try to use my bow and arrow. Fire, that's ice, can I shoot it from that far away? No. But you know what guys, I think I'm just going to stop this video here. So thanks for watching guys, I'll see you guys in the next episode. Bye guys!